Okay, this lesson I want you to create a file management system for your Adobe project. So I want a folder that says Adobe CC and inside it I want a folder for Illustrator, Photoshop, Audition, Premiere, and then inside those I want subfolders. So inside the Illustrator I want a development folder. That's where you'll be working on projects that are sort of in progress and then production will be like your finished project. So whatever you create inside this folder that's you know finally finished you can put it over here and then when you're all done you don't have to sort through all the you know miscellaneous uh, pieces of files and imported pieces of this and that graphic arts whatever you can just go straight here and find your finished polished products and then imported work you know put it in there fonts that you use a lot I, I want a lot of organization for your project so let's start with Adobe CC I'm just gonna hit control C and over here in my my drive I have my video tutorials you don't have a video tutorials just put it in your my drive but uh, I'm gonna create a folder like I said called Adobe CC and then inside that folder I want another folder and I want four folders illustrator <coughs> Photoshop, Audition, and Premiere, Premiere. Okay, so then going back to the guide here, I want inside Illustrator, I want development, production, imported work, and favorite fonts. Illustrator, where are you? There you are. <clears throat> I want the development production imported work and favorite fonts okay so then inside there uh, for example, for me, I, my band's name is The Garland Pool, and I also have a project that I'm working on for a scientist called Bug Bites. Uh, it's a website identifying bees. And then uh, my testing system that I've developed for my students to use is RSO Test. So I would maybe fictitiously or hypothetically be developing these. So I'd want a folder because you don't want your bug bites folders getting mixed up with your garland pool folders and RSO test. If they're all in the same folder, it's going to be madness. So I'm going to have a separate folder for each. So where is it? Development, create folder, paste that. Uh, I'll just copy and paste. I'm just going to double click, control C, folder, Control V. I don't need the extra uh, space at the end. Double click. Control C. Go over here. New folder. Control V. And I don't think I can copy these or I'd do the same thing for the production folder. But that's what I'm going to need. I'm going to want one for each one. And then no subfolders in here. You might choose to have subfolders once you get going. But I want the same thing for Photoshop. I want uh, album covers. So for my band, I've, I've made uh, in Photoshop, I've made album covers for all my albums. I have Love Like Mary. That's the first album I published on Spotify. Second one was this. And so I just use these as examples. I now have four albums on Spotify and more coming. Uh, I don't have any movie posters, but uh, if you did, and I do want you later to make in Photoshop, these will be some of the projects we make. So b basically, build this uh, file structure as you see it here, and um, and then do it for Audition, and do it for Premiere, and just follow this guide. I will give you the link to this um, so that you can follow the guide. And that's the assignment. Have fun.